Your uterus is about three inches from top to bottom and two inches wide at the widest part. It's about one inch thick and weighs around one ounce. Your uterus is one of the most unique organs in your body. It can stretch from the size of a lemon to the size of a watermelon during pregnancy. Your uterus can be up to two pounds when your baby is born. Your uterus shrinks down to its normal size and position about six weeks postpartum after giving birth through a process called involution. Before pregnancy, most of the space in your abdomen is taken up by the large and small intestines. There is no real separation between the areas of your pelvis and abdomen. In its normal position, your uterus is above and behind the bladder, with the cervix protruding into the vagina. The pelvic colon, rectum, and anal canal are behind the vagina and uterus. At six to seven weeks of pregnancy, you may be experiencing early signs of pregnancy, including your period stopping, nausea, breast tenderness and swelling, frequent urination, and fatigue. At this point, your uterus has begun to grow and become more egg-shaped. The pressure of the growing uterus on the bladder causes a frequent urge to urinate. At the 12th week of pregnancy, your uterus is the size of a grapefruit and completely fills the pelvis. The fundus, the upper end of the uterus, is just above the top of the symphysis where the pubic bones join together. This upward growth of the uterus takes pressure off the bladder and decreases the need for frequent urination. At the 20th week of pregnancy, your uterus can be felt at the level of your belly button or umbilicus. The pelvic colon and small intestines are crowded upward and backward. The ascending and descending colon maintain their usual positions. At this point, your uterus is especially enlarged where the placenta attaches to it. At this point in pregnancy, the top of your uterus is about one-third of the distance between the belly button and the xiphoid cartilage at the lower end of your breastbone. Constipation is common because your uterus is pressing on your lower colon and hormones slow down your body's excretion process. Between the growth of your uterus and general weight gain, you may be feeling fatigued. Some women also experience heartburn as your uterus presses against your stomach. At 36 weeks of pregnancy, your enlarged uterus almost fills the space within your abdomen. The muscles of your abdomen support much of its weight. At this point, the top of the uterus is at the tip of the xiphoid cartilage at the lower end of the breastbone, which is pushed forward. At full term, or 40 weeks of pregnancy, the fetus head has generally lowered into your pelvis, where it takes up most of the space. This is called lightning. The canal of the broad and large cervix is still filled with the plug of mucus. If this is your first pregnancy, the small opening at the bottom of your cervix is usually not dilated, whereas if you have given birth before, it will often be open as wide as two fingers sometime before labor begins. You can see that the round ligament is long and enlarged. It is also farther forward because of the twisting of the uterus. The enlarged uterosacral ligament is shown stretched taut by the enlarged uterus. Backaches in late pregnancy may be due to the stress of the weight of your uterus on the ligaments that connect it to your spine.